Hey, I'm Lucas Castelloni, and you're watching Hollywire. What's up, Hollywire? We have Lucas Castellani in the studio with us today. Thank you for being here. Thank you for having me. So we're gonna play a round of What's Worth. So if you're going to the gym, is it worse to forget your headphones to go to the gym mm -hmm. or to forget your headphones to go on a flight? Can you fly without your headphones or work out without your headphones? I mean, I cannot fly without my headphones. Same. Definitely going on a fly without your headphones is the worst thing ever. A restaurant getting your food order wrong or a barista getting your coffee order wrong? The restaurants getting my food ordered okay, wrong. Full meal. Oh no, that's the nightmares. You, you wait for so long. You're there. You're waiting. Then when the food comes out, just not right. I mean, I totally get Hailey Bieber getting mad at that girl. <laughs> <laughs> no shade. I'm just. Oh my goodness, no, that's hard. You're starving at that point. A coffee, you can turn it around quickly. I right. get you. Okay. Obviously, you look amazing. Thank kind you. of an off-duty vibes, but I just I feel like we have to kick this off. Tell me about this outfit. Tell me about your fashion and your everyday life and red carpets. You're the expert, we wanna know. Well, fashion is my life, you know? I feel like every day I wake up and I, I'm like, how can I express myself to the world? And I feel like fashion is the first way to do it. So I know every time somebody's gonna look at me, they're gonna pay attention to what I'm wearing. So I want to send a message out every day, you know? And that also helps me feel more confident and go out and about and do what I I'm trying to do with the world, so fashion is just part of me these days. A hundred percent, I love that. And I know, correct me if I'm wrong, you kind of found your way into the influencing space sort of organically. You started anonymously, is that correct, on MySpace? And then you sort of built a community there, revealed your identity, and people came over and fell in love with you for your fashion. What was that process like of like choosing to reveal and put your name out there and let people really fall in love with you for you? <laughs> yeah, no, I did start anonymously. I was kind of like the gossip girl of my school. So basically I was just reporting what was happening with me uh -huh. on my MySpace blog and just posting whatever was happening every day at school and kind of showing people under the bus, the people that were bullying me. So right. I, was, I was kind of bullying them back, <laughs> just, you know, spreading the gossip around and nobody knew who was that. Right. And then somebody found out, you know, one of my best friends who became mad at me with something and then, you know, the friends had become your enemy. Sure, sure. So she put out there that I was the, the blog and the MySpace page and then it was crazy. My, my school at the time had about 5,000 5, students. Wow. So okay. only my school was really big and then the blog was one of the most visited pages in Brazil ever. We had like 5 million access weekly. Oh my God. I know you have a new show coming out. I gotta know about this show, okay? There's not a lot out there right now, you guys. <laughs> you gotta tell me, what is this show going to be? I know your followers are going to love it. It comes out very soon. It's called The Castellani Show. The Castellani. I love it. <laughs> the Castellani Show. It comes out next week on Fox. Okay. So everyone can just, you know, tune in and watch it. And I'm just very, very happy to be um, basically breaking barriers. Uh -huh. So basically the Castellani show is all about diversity, identity, relatability. I, you know, I'm part of the LGBTQ plus community. Uh -huh. I'm brown, I'm an immigrant, I have a thick accent, and yet I'm hosting a show on TV. I'm like, wow. Hey, Lucas, will you walk over to the drip camera and show us your look? All right, I'll give you a runway walk. Yes! <laughs> Hello guys, I'm Lucas Castellani, and this is my drip. Who is a fashion icon to me? Uh, right now, I think it's Zendaya. Zendaya is totally killing it. I mean, every time she's on a red carpet is just an iconic moment that you never forget. I got this outfit today on The Real Real, actually. I've worked with them, so they have amazing cool staff. Actually, I totally recommend The Real Real for the holidays, any gifts, they have everything. And this is Gucci and Saint Laurent and Valentino shoes and I just, you know, looked at it and I fell in love with it, so. 
I felt that was my dream for today. My dream outfit for a red carpet? Um, I feel like uh, any custom-made outfits by Alexander McQueen, John Galliano, um, Olivia Roostang, those are my dream outfits for any red carpet. I've been slaying a few of those designers on any red carpets, but none of the things that I've been wearing are custom-made. But they get to, you know, do something special for this body. I'm here for you! <laughs> All right, guys, thank you so much. I'm Lucas Castellani, and this is my drip. All right, well, thank you so, so much for being here. Congratulations on everything. We cannot wait to watch your show. You guys, this has been Lucas Castellani with us in the studio. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Thank you for having me, guys. I'll be back. <laughs>